In order to help combat homelessness, millions of dollars are going to organizations that deal with Tallahassee's most vulnerable. ABC 27's Micah Cho joins us live from Tallahassee now. Micah, why are these services receiving so much money? Channing, continuing of care tells me this money will make an enormous impact when it comes to helping the thousands of homeless in Tallahassee. Getting our homeless off the streets, that's what a multi-million dollar grant is expected to do. And each year, our community should, you know, set goals that were better than what we met the last year. Amanda Wander, executive director for the Big Bend Continuum of Care, tells me they've seen a decline in homelessness in Leon County by 29%. Now with $1.4 million being received by the organization through the American Rescue Plan, they'll be able to help organizations like the Kearney Center with community outreach and diversion programs that will help take more people out of the streets and into transitional housing, providing rental assistance and food services. This is um, a huge, I, I would say more than a step, it's a leap forward. Additionally, Community Human Services Partnership will receive $3.4 million and will develop a homeless services category acting as community outreach. County Commissioner Rick Miner says the amount of this funding will help the organization get into the community and provide extra services alongside continuum of care. This funding is going to help us make some inroads, uh, but there's still a lot of work we need to do. I mean, the need out there is so great. So what we need to do as a community is make sure that we, we, we spend this money wisely and make sure that we get the greatest results with the limited resources that we have. Now, COC usually gets their money from a housing and urban development, and they'll be able to use that money soon, while CHSP will get their money starting in 2023. In Tallahassee, I'm Micah Cho for ABC 27.